In this video, we are going to learn a numeric palette from conversion and it is two time string. Okay, now let's just see the help that it converts a number to a time stamp. Okay, so let's just uh, create an example, just uh, one control and one indicator. Okay, so if you play this, it won't print anything right now means all things are initialized right now now let's just make one here okay so one one two thousand four or maybe nineteen four five thirty one second okay so this is the time now why it is giving that time directly when you give one there so for that let's just go to detail head so that you can see some I asked so you can get some idea now a number can be a scalar number array of array or cluster of numbers array of clusters of numbers and so on so that just what you can give as an input but what it represent is the amount of seconds from the epoch time of 12 am January 1, 1904. So, whenever you give one, it will start the time from 1, 1, 1904. Okay, and it will give you the output or the timestamp using that uh, value. Okay, so this is the epoch time. That, uh, that's why it is giving that uh, that value directly. Okay, so let's just give 60 here. Okay, 60 seconds means 530, 60. 60 means 531. Okay, now, like suppose give 10,000. Okay, 8, 16, 40. Let's just give whatever number you can give. Just try to give it and uh, let's see okay so this is 19 November 11 16 39 11 hour 16 minute 39 seconds okay so this is how you can convert number into timestamp okay so that's it for now we will see some more examples uh, in next video